What's up guys, Do here again, and I'm going to bring you another tutorial on syncing. So, um, I don't really know how to explain it. It's like cutting up clips and then you put one after the other, so it looks like... Well, I'll just let you see for yourself. Right here. Hold on, let me go full screen. See how the clips are all cut up? That's what I'm going to be teaching you how to do. So, if we open up this, um, I gotta look up, look up one of those. No. No. I'll just use one of these. I'll just use this for just for the tutorial sake. So 59.94, make a new composition. Same old deal. So you want to drag this on. I'm going to bring the scale up to 105. And I'm going to slap on a really, really quick preset. Looks. Decides to open. Right. So, dark blue glow might be good, or nasty red blur. I think I might prefer dark blue glow. Nah, too much film grain. It's pretty good. I turn this off. No, I kind of like it dark. But if we have it dark, I wanted to get rid of it yet. I like the blue, but I think we're missing a light flex. I'm gonna add this on really, really quickly. Um, four point two ish. Does not look without. All right, so it doesn't look too bad. So what we're going to do is we're going to add our Twixter. So look up Tweak Store and drag it onto the clip. And you're gonna to wanna to double click this button to make it frame blending pixel motion. So frame blending is on pixel motion. Time, you wanna enable time remapping. I'm going to turn this to that. And then, so here's how you start it. So, how I did in this tutorial was I clicked the keyframe at 100, moved forward one frame, and then went to 5. So, depending on how long you want each little sync to be, I'll do 2 seconds and then. So, he moves a little. So, I'll do like 1. Point f Actually, yeah, I'll do 2 seconds, no biggie. And then cut the clip and delete it. And so, this is the first part. And then what you need to do, I'm sorry, I'm really bad at explaining this. It's kind of complicated for me. What you need to do after this, you need to bring in a new clip, and then you need to find the part where you want the other thing to begin. The next little sync. So, this isn't the best clip to be doing it with, but I'm going to pick it because I don't want to waste any time. Probably said that already. Um, pixel motion, same old deal. Um, 59.94. Did I f change it for this one? Nope. And keyframe 100. Go forward, frame, go 5. Go forward 2 seconds. Split it. And then one more time. I will start it off right here at the tweak store. Time speed, same thing, go to five and go for two seconds. Now, 
So when we ran preview, oh wait, turn the auto off or that's gonna sound really, really ugly. I'm gonna ran preview this real quick. It's on quarter, so it shouldn't take too long. And this is what I did in the promo. Okay, so. So you need to match this to the beats of your song. So if you if you have a beat every second, obviously you don't want this to be two seconds long. You want to make drag this back to one second, then drag that back to where it begins. So this would be down to one second, and then that would stop at two, and then this would start at two, and then it would stop at three. You can add as much as you want. I'm sorry if this tutorial was a little vague, it was requested, and um, I have no idea how to like, what to call this, so if you have, I know it is syncing, um, but other than that, I mean, it's just cutting up clips, so I don't know what to call it, so I'm just gonna, I don't know what I'm gonna put for the title, but nonetheless, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, I found it helpful, a lot of it was common sense, I'm sorry if you knew it. Um, because a lot of people do, because it's just really logical. But, um, yeah, I will try to post another tutorial tomorrow to try to get, like, some more quality out there to try to maybe go over an effect. I'm going to have to use my imagination on this one. But I've been super busy over the uh, weekdays. So, um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Um, I hope you downloaded my color correction pack. It has stuff like this, all customizable, magical looks. And I'll catch you guys later. Bye-bye.